Anders, I know you too well. I knew you would never give up. What's wrong? Why are you talking like... I was too rebellious, like you. The Templars knew I had to be... made an example of. No! How else will mages ever master themselves? You'll understand, Anders. As soon as the Templars teach you to control yourself. This is the apostate. Take another mage as you took him! Anders, what did you do? It's like... you brought a piece of the Fade into this world. I had already forgotten what that feels like. I thought the Tranquil were cut off from the Fade forever. When you're Tranquil, you never think on your life before. But... it's like the Fade itself is inside, Anders. Burning like a sun. Please, kill me before I forget again. I don't know how you brought it back, but it's fading. Carl, no. Maybe we can find a cure. Can you cure a beheading? The dreams of tranquil mages are severed. There is nothing left of them to fix. I would rather die a mage than live as a Templar puppet. My sister calls being tranquil a fate worse than death. Give him peace. I got here too late. I'm sorry, Carl. I'm so sorry. Now! It's fading! Why do you look at me like that? Goodbye. <laughs> we should leave before more Templars come.